This week's ABC 57 Road Trip honors Juneteenth, the newly recognized federal holiday that commemorates the freedom of all enslaved African Americans in 1865. ABC 57's Naja Woods stopped by the DuSable Black History Museum and Education Center in Chicago to share some of that important history. Well, we're here at the DuSable Museum where we're not only going to learn about black history, but American history. Let's go. I'm with seven other young black men and we wanted to learn our history better because we want to expand more in our area. We're from East St. Louis, um, but we want to start a statewide uh, initiative and get more young black men active in this role and understand our roots and seeing that vulnerability is power. Jalen Cow and his group made the trip to Chicago from St. Louis. They're among thousands of people who travel from all around the world to visit the Drusabo Black History Museum and Education Center, the oldest independent black history museum in the nation. We were founded in 1961 by the wonderful Dr. Margaret T. Burroughs, who herself was an educator and a poet and an artist, and she started her museum in her home in Bronzeville, uh, which is a neighborhood here on the south side of Chicago. The museum, named after Jean-Baptiste Point du Sable, the Haitian-born founder of Chicago, celebrates and educates everyone about the rich history of black people well before slavery. It's so important to have an identity in culture and an accurate history, right? We start our story with the beauty of the freedom of the black family and tribal life in West Africa before the crime of slavery was committed. And then we move up through the slave trade and the civil rights movement. So it's a really comprehensive story that you'll hear here, and it's narrated by us for us. The DuSable Museum also features pieces from world-renowned black artists, an entire World War I exhibit on black troops who fought for our country, and a traveling exhibit on Emmett Till, all sharing different stories. We have a traveling exhibit that is on display right now through July 16th, 2023, uh, that is a story of Emmett Till and it is really made for younger audiences. Um, so I would encourage your viewers to come and see that exhibit, uh, Let the World See. The museum allows you to learn not only about black culture around America, but black culture here in Chicago and its rich black history. For example, this is the story of my time as a public servant. And we have an exhibit on our first black mayor, Harold Washington. On top of all of this, the Family Friendly Museum is home to the largest Juneteenth celebration in Chicago. The now federal holiday recognizing the freedom of all enslaved African Americans in 1865 and commemorated for centuries among black communities. Slaves in Texas had no idea that they were free, legally free, until like more than two years later. Uh, so we celebrate Juneteenth as Emancipation, as Freedom Day uh, that originated in Texas. And of course we know that only last year it became a real recognized holiday. Uh, so we're really excited to celebrate it. And as everyone comes together to celebrate freedom, it's crucial to acknowledge America's painful past that got us here and still impacts us today. The police killing of George Floyd sparking a nationwide movement across communities to unite, including right here in the city of Chicago. This artwork brought from around the city to right here at the DuSable Museum. I don't want people to get confused and thinking this is just for black people. This is actual history. It is important to understand where you come from, what your history is, what the impact of that history is on our lives currently, and most importantly, how do we take that knowledge in order to move forward and make good history, make better history, uh, more equality, more humanity going forward. From Chicago, Nadja Woods, ABC 57 News. The Juneteenth celebration at the DuSable History Museum and Education Center is happening Monday, and it is free to the public. It will also celebrate the 50th anniversary of hip-hop, featuring music, food, games, and more. To learn more, just head on over to our website, abc57.com.